Hey traders, this is Tosh. I go by T Bradley 90 in MIC, my investing club chat. Today, one of our moderators named Chicago Trader, real name Matt, does a video for us today where he dives into the BPTH fundamental analysis, and this is episode 11. And we've got a preview for you guys today. If you want to watch the full video, then become an exclusive member. All right, let's get into it. Hey, what's going on, guys? It's Chicago Trader checking in with the weekly fundamental video. <clears throat> Hope you guys are having a nice week of trading and all the uh, chaos. So, with uh, BPTH, I uh, will go through this real quick. So, they did the offering, what was it, Monday or Tuesday? Monday morning. And I wanted to show you guys something in the press release that I uh, had kind of missed initially. Let's go through this. So yeah, it tells you the float here. Um, something that I missed was, let's go back up. Yeah, so the delivery of the shares are on March 14th, which would be the end of close today, I believe. It's either today or tomorrow. But this won't be added to the float until March 14th and definitely on March 15th, obviously. So the flow would be, you know, right around 2.4 million and then it reduces, you know, what they have to close that to be above the $75 million shelf. So my apologies for kind of messing that one up. I'd actually, um, you guys would be surprised if you guys have questions, you can email, um, you know, investor relations with the CFOs. And this guy actually got back to me twice, which is a record you're lucky to get one. And I had kind of uh, clarified it that, you know, they could be, uh, you know, it's going to be delivered this day and that that's when they're added to the float. So if you guys have any questions, any names, I know a lot of you guys DM me throughout the day, which I love to answer the questions and try to be as helpful as possible. But uh, yeah, this was just uh, AQB and uh, it'll be interesting. I, I don't like to make predictions on when something's going to offer, but, um, you know, they've supported BPTH uh, fairly well here after the offering. Um, my guess, and again, it's a guess, would be either Friday after the close or Monday morning, uh, if they can support it that high, because, you know, some of these uh, brokers that charge the huge overnight fees, 3x, you know, every day, and then, you know, those are, those go into the weekend as well, or 7x or whatever those, you know, you guys are paying. Fridays, you know, it's not a common if it's being held up for it to be, you know, kind of squeezed out and people just cover at the end of the day on a Friday. and. Um, push it up a little bit higher, not wanting to pay, you know, those ridiculous fees. But uh, again, just my theory, be interesting to see how it plays out. So I haven't really traded the stock very much. Hey traders, this is Tosh. I go by T Bradley 90 in the My Investing Club chat. Just wanted to reach out and say, if you have any questions about MIC, joining MIC, maybe you're a member already, you have three ways to contact myself personally and through MIC. You can hit our social media, you can hit me through PMs in chat, or you can contact us through my email at tosh at myinvestingclub.com. That's T-O-S-H at myinvestingclub.com. I will get back to you in a timely manner, and I'm saying this because I'm here to help, and I don't want anybody to be afraid to reach out and ask any question that they have. We are here for you guys. All right, see you guys.